How's it going everyone? I went to the local uh, card shop today and picked up uh, a box of tier 1, much to my surprise. Um, this is probably the highest end product I've ever gotten. I've gotten Topps High Tech before. Um, one, one box of that, That's and besides that, this is definitely the highest end product I've ever gotten. So hoping for, hoping for something good, hoping it's worth my while. Um, so uh, let's go ahead and get right into it. Um, so yeah, there's the odds if you're interested in that. Um, so yeah, there's the box. Three cards inside, two autographs, one relic card. Uh, some packs do have like an extra hit, uh, uh, sort of like a extra relic card, I think. Um, so uh, yeah, just really curious to see what we're gonna get. So wish me luck. Without further ado. what we have. Looks like we've got a bat relic here on the, the first card. So Calrican Jr. bat relic. 175 out of 200. Not too bad there. Let's see what this first autograph is. Oh, so this is actually looks like it's going to be a an extra. Oh man, that card is dinged up. Um, so it looks like, yeah, it's going to be a box with an extra hit. So here's a pinstripe Carlos Gonzalez out of 331. And then so that, I guess that means, yeah, so we got an extra relic card. Let's see what this first autograph is. Kelvin Herrera, 178 out of 300. And then behind that, Tim Cooney for the Indians, 136 out of 300. Uh, so not too bad. I think it did look like. And these cards were next to each other. It looked like one of these were, were dinged up a little bit. I think it's this one. Yeah, there's a nice little dip in there. Uh, but still, overall, not too bad of a break. Uh, so we got the Carlos Gonzalez relic. We got this Cal Rookin Jr. bat relic out of 200. It's pretty cool. And then the two autographs were Tim Cooney and Kelvin Herrera. So, thanks for watching.